And as I make this statement, your facial expression is also going to change. In the Liberian community, in Liberia, there is no corrupt person. None is corrupt. Liberia has all the resources in the world. We got a rainforest, we got an ocean, we got, we got gold, we got diamond, just name it, name it. But why is it like Liberia is the way it is? It's because we, as a society, there is nobody that is corrupt in Liberia. <laughs> There is nobody that's growing like you. The problem with Liberians and the Liberian society is we have the tendency to not take personal responsibility. The next person beside me is corrupt. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I said nobody is corrupt in the Liberian or society in the Liberian community. Nobody. Because if you talk about corruption, who is corrupt? Not me. Not me. <laughs> the next person is corrupt. You tell the next person, no, I'm not corrupt. That person is corrupt. As you will see in the video that, uh, that Uma Johnson talked about, we need to take personal responsibility. It is the masses that make history. But in order for the masses to change things in the course of making history, they have to be organized. Organize yourself. That's how you overcome any issue that you have. Find other people who are suffering from the same situation and care as much as you do about changing it. You do that, you organize, and then you put pressure on local government, you put pressure on each other because some things don't need to be changed at the governmental level. They need to be changed at the community level. We want to look at the government, right? And everybody says the government is corrupt. But what about you as an individual? Are you not corrupt? Because if you do not take personal responsibility and you point it at the other person, we cannot and we will not do away with corruption. If you have the agenda of the people foremost in your mind, you can't sell them out. But when you're only motivated by what you can gain for you and your family, that's where the sellouts are born. Sellouts come from selfishness. And this is the window of opportunity we are in right now when it comes to Liberia, when it comes to the president, when it comes to the government. If we as a people do not step up in the diaspora and at home to help close the gap, and we have nobody else to blame but ourselves. I went on TLC and I came across this uh, quotation. It said, don't cross the darkness. Light a candle instead. <laughs>